Right. Just arrived from NJT. So this is body made by B Hefner, their vintage 50s strap body. It's one piece which they upgraded for a charge, should have been a two piece but I asked for a particular nice grainy piece of ash and then what they done is they just gave me this really nice body but in a one piece. So I didn't have to pay the upcharge that they normally charge. Sent it through to MJT. And this is what they came up with. So. Well packaged. So exciting. So this was ordered just before Christmas 2016 and it's now 17th, 18th of January, 17th of January, February, February, 17th of February 2017. Wow. There we are. So that's front of the back. Okay, so it's 50s body. Standard route. I don't know if you can see that. It's a bit dusty. Contoured heel on it, as opposed to just a standard heel joint. And that was again, it was a custom option from B Hefner. So I've gone from a gone for a medium relic didn't want anything that was used and abused but I wanted it to look like it had been used so you can see that it's got a very thin nitro finish don't know if you can see that the paint has sort of sunk into it it's got the broken glass checking and you got a little bit of forearm wear don't like it when it's overworn and the same with the buckle rash there is wear, but it's not it's not overly done whatsoever. You can see it's got it's got age marks, it's got where the paint has sunken into the wood. It's got chips. Some of the chips go all the way through the body to the, the wood, and some of them just literally go through to the uh, the base yellow. So that's looking excellent. For all you nerds out there. There we go. Just under four pounds. Three and th three pounds, two to three, four pounds. It's not too bad. So it's one piece, as I said. Ultra light. Don't know what that difference that makes. So, just for a bit of fun, I made a separate video on my channel uh, where I was looking at different relic parts. This is from the Art of Aging set. So this is a 57 single ply pit guard. So, stick that there. These are the Art of Aging. These are the um, standard aged Bakelite style covers for a 56 strap so I'm going for that 55-56 looking before they turned into before they started using order so let's just put these on just for a bit of visual effect 
really good quality these I think and as you can see sort of standard oh, consistent sort of relic to look doesn't they've all fallen through but I don't need to do much about that pickups aren't coming yet got the knobs with regards to pickups probably going to go for the Don Mare Brown tones because I'm going to go for that sort of Clapton Brownie I know it's a uh, Oh, I know this is an ash body, not an older one like the brownie, but it's, uh, I prefer ash, I like the look of it, and it's a hybrid of that, I mean, it's not exactly vintage correct, because it's got a contoured, contoured heel. This is uh, an all parts relict um, jack socket, so not overly done, no sort of dodgy sort of chemical wear, it's just nicely aged and it will age even further on its own naturally so that's what it's looking like and my fat fingers so hopefully there's a bit of consistency between the way the body looks and the relic in of the uh, of the plastic parts that's the front, bear with. Okay, going with the back. Again, this is the Art of Aging series. 56. It's got the little round holes. Again, this is the all parts neck plate. Gonna have to get two short screws because of obviously the uh, thinner there but you can see again and get that to really get it to focus that's better so Okay, so I'm sure you can see, well you can see some of it, just the subtle chips, dings and scratches, the whole theme behind this is to make it look like it's been played, it's been used, it's been gigged, but it's not been abused, this is sort of, well I never seen many real strats unless you go for Stevie Ray's number one and Rory Gallagher's but apart from that I'm not really madly relict naturally okay back to the front again you can see that contoured heel is still quite subtle just takes that Square chunk off. It's recording. Get that dust off. I like that checking it on there. I'll take some pictures as well. If that brings up any sort of anything different. I'm gonna shield the guitar just for sake of it. <laughs> 